Welcome back to season 14 of AOR. We are now at round 4, which is just Russia, as you can see, and it's pouring down. Yeah, so we are on the intermediate tires, um, and I'm trying to do my best here. It's been a heavy rain session, and now it's gone to uh, to intermediates. Um, so obviously it's tricky. So it's about getting out as late as possible, which I have done. Um, but as you can see, I'm green, but it's so difficult especially this corner here to stay on the power as you can see I just have a tiny slide here as well um, and it's very very difficult to just have any grip because it's going to be dry in the race so I am driving right now with a dry setup because I didn't want to comprom compromise my race but obviously that means that qualifying is going to be even trickier and as you can see in P13 um, which isn't very impressive for me and this race was the first in a while because we had a three week break uh, because of obviously I think the US and Mexican Grand Prix um, were happening at the same time as our races so it's a three week break and in that meantime uh, I managed to break my uh, controller a bit so the force feedback sort of doesn't work properly um, so this was really an uphill battle for me this race um, but especially now the rain attraction is so important so it's, it's quite difficult um, but obviously just gonna have to do my best um, I can't really sit and complain um, but we are now heading into the final sector here this short left right hander here which is quite difficult not to slide but I sort of managed to hold it a bit um, and we now go down to just these last two 90 degree corners which isn't really too difficult but I obviously managed to log up anyway classic me and now we're gonna go across the line what is it gonna be so we're in the forces it looked like p9 there on the screen but yeah that's what it's gonna be which i think is good um so we're gonna have the free tire trust anyway so so that's great and now let's head into the race so here we are on the grid as you can see i've chosen the ultra soft tires as the guys ahead of me have as well but i think we have uh, the guys behind me are probably on the hearts or super softs to gain an advantage later in the race. I said hearts, what do we mean? Probably soft tires maybe, but let's see what we can do. We are quite far behind here. Can we dive it up the inside? I don't think so. We're just going to go around here. Close a battle with the Force India here. This is going to be tricky going into the fourth corner here. He's going to be in the inside, obviously I'm going to have to try and take the outside line. Is he going to give me the space? He is, nice. And obviously with a bit of traction on the ultra shot, we should be Gucci, and we are. So now, oh no, he's going to come back at us. This is close, but I think, have I managed to grab the position? This is too far back, no, he's still on the inside. We're going to go around the outside, this is a great battle, we won a bit right, but obviously had to, and now I just let him go, but there's Big C, I think, trying to get up on the inside of the world. I cut that corner massively but hopefully none of the other guys notice and now Big is the guy ahead and he's on the ultras as well so we can't really let him get away but now obviously there isn't any DRS yet but this isn't Bix this is Tanner so this is going crazy with battles right now but can I go on the well it's gonna be the outside soon can I yeah Ooh, can I stay on the track no I just go a bit wide and lose it there but oh and then there is Big He's on the super soft tires, so obviously, but now I'm here. Can I go down the inside? This first lap is proving to be mental. Can I do the switch back? No, I don't think so. He's just a bit too far ahead there, but obviously on the straight we should have uh, the opportunity to do so. Even without the DRS, because I think the slipstream is still going to be good enough, but I sort of bought that last corner a bit and he just got the edge on me, so I doubt that we'll be able to do anything and we couldn't. Can I jump up to jumping over to lap 4 as we are gonna can we dive up the inside oh I break too late just like I did last week in Bahrain and I sort of hit Bixi here and I slowed down here to give me the position back but I think he has broken some of his front wing he definitely got angry at me after the race and texted me that I broke his wing so I think this is the incident he was talking about oh he's going up the inside and we nearly collided there but I just managed to avoid it so obviously I should be able to get back at him now because as you can see, yeah, he's going wide. He must have front wing damage. Um, can I go around the outside here? No, it's not an overtaking spot. So now I think it's just going to be a uh, way to the back straight, and then I should be able to have him in the braking zone. 
um, if everything goes according to plan. But this has been a mental start to the race, especially that first lap. All the battling going on was crazy. We should now have the DRS. I think we are putting it up to Rich here, and then we're gonna get him. But uh, he's too far away again. Hopefully, he'll bottle it down here in the braking zone. Oh, he has! What a time for my Igata to fuck up. But he, he, uh, yeah, he fucked it up as well. And we are now up into P9. Oh, he's gonna come back and dive again. That's a, ooh, that's a bit of a dirty move, I think. It's kind of a rushberg like But we've now got the Force India around my so I've devout here. So this is gonna be very, very feisty going down the uh, the main straight here. Oh, I bottle it again. I can't really get on the power. So obviously, but Devout seems is gonna is gonna have a look at uh, at Bixie now. No, it's too far away. Yeah, yeah, it's too far away. So we're just gonna follow each other here. But maybe I can get um, closer to them in the middle sector because obviously I am on the ultra softs and they are on the super softs. So I should have more grip. And there aren't really anywhere at all on Sochi. So I should still have a lot better tires. As you can see, it just goes a bit wide. This leaves at the chance. Come on, I'll break him. Yeah, there we go. And we are back in the points where we belong. So hopefully I'm going to be able to stay behind him. But I did go for a bit more downforce uh, to help me in this middle sector. But uh, on the straight, it's really hurting me, as you can probably tell. I haven't really been slipstreaming uh, as much, which could be an issue when I have to overtake or defend as we'll probably see in a second here where he's gonna have the um, massive toe on me here going down to this braking zone yeah he's already on my inside can I defend Ooh, I brake late again I've really been struggling on the brakes here and I clip my front wing for fuck's sake just like I did in China as well so this is gonna be so difficult right now and I did in Bahrain, I've destroyed my front wing in all my races, so this isn't a, a, a good sign. But we are now also with me, Heis, and here, here. And then we've got Devout and Bixi fighting it up ahead. Ooh, they went right there. So we're gonna be so, we're gonna be four cars within a second on this straight. It's gonna be incredible. I just had to, ooh, I just had to lift up there, as I think some lag might have occurred there. But we're now sideways. As you can see, can I slipstream, Heis? Come on. No, I think he's just too far back. Oh, I break too late. Oh, and he's hit me for fuck's sake. No, don't get off me. And that's an orange run ring for me. And Devout race is ruined. So that wasn't too great. Um, I didn't mean to overtake highs. It just sort of happened. Uh, just like it did in Bahrain. I've not been super good in the brakes so far. Um, and um, I pitted, obviously, for the soft tires. And I'm so far behind because, obviously, there's no safety car. So there's no way I'm getting back. And Sachi is an easy over, uh, one stop, so there's literally no chance of anything at all. So I'm just gonna jump ahead to when I finish because absolutely nothing happened. But I did have some very hectic first laps, so that sort of made up for it in some way. And I finished P12. Don't look at my penalties, that wasn't too pretty. But hopefully, I can improve next time in Spain, and I will see you then.